Hey everyone, I'm Alfred, and welcome back to the Mata Nui Online game. Last time we rescued this, uh, knucklehead from the snow. I, if I remember correctly, his name is Kopik, um, and part of his character's, part of his character development is that he is, uh, not very widely spoken. Okay. See all these little lines? They just... Are these arms? And is this a torso? Hold on. Are these arms? Is this a torso? Is this a head? And are these legs and feet? Because then that means that they have like a little symbol of a Matoran on their body, on the body of a Matoran. Uh, who are you? Kopik. Yeah, his deal is that he's like very soft-spoken. Um, later he's made the like new chronicler. I don't know if he deserves it. <laughs> Let him to the Takora Guard. Could have led him to the ice. Fear they won't return. Had you not come and saved me, I would have been facing a similar fate. Do not wish to be questioned. Seek answers to Sen Kokoro. You'll find meditation and contemplation. Dragon Uchi's way to think on things, and from a on sanctum on Ihu's peak, one can see far ahead and far behind. In Kokoro, we respect knowledge above all things. You must have great knowledge to even step foot within it. You don't know who seeks to chronicle this era, so you doubtless travel the icy drifts in search of answers, but true sight reveals many things. And knowing the future can be dangerous. That is your choice. Wisdom is ever the burden of the Turaga. I do not expect it from you. So when he speaks, he he speaks. Okay. This one is simple. Oh, this symbol means earth, doesn't it? We know that this one means air, and that's the masks of... Let me switch these. It's the mask of uh, Liwa and Matau. Nokama's mask goes here. Your mask goes here. That's the Huna. There we go. See, I should have known. I didn't remember it because it hasn't been used past this year. But this makes sense. If that, if if this is the, oh, hold on, I gotta find where my cursor is. If this is the symbol for Earth, then that means that we should have known that the little peg that has uh, a line and four dots on it should be the thing that says we go to the Earth, uh, the Earth Toa's mask. Gray Kakama with white looks cool. Uh, yeah, I think that this is the, the thing that's a Lego, uh, the Lego group's copyright. Welcome to the Sanctum, Traveler. You may join in meditation if you wish. Nuju One uh, honors all the wise of Matoran that they may join in the seeking. Do you wish to speak with him? You must wait for Matoro to return. He's the only one that can translate Nuju's wisdom. So yeah, um, possibly to make, uh, possibly to make the characters a little more diverse and interesting, Nuju made a choice years ago to not speak Matoran. He only speaks uh, this like click whistle language that is commonly understood by birds. Sorry, I paused it there to cough. Uh, yeah, he speaks this language that is understood more commonly by birds. Um, and he usually teaches a Matoran to translate. He teaches the language to the Matoran so he may translate it. Anything you wish to know from me? What's he seeking? What is thee seeking? And none of these walls and tablets of the great prophecies. To understand even a fraction of what they speak takes years of meditation and patient decryption. Um, Komatoran often use the skies and use the stars to create prophecies and spend a lot of time looking to the future. Um, as opposed to like Gamatoran and Onumatoran who spend a lot of time looking to the past. Uh, Lamatoran live in the now. I think you could argue that Tomatorn do too and Pomatorn are always looking ahead to like see what the next big thing is you know what what next thing are we building what next sporting event is we're you know that sort of thing Nuju is the Traga of Kokoro his prophecy is reached into the past and future and has deciphered much of the ancient prophecies he has visions capital V he does very little that is not significant in some way to the future of Mananui and the Kanoe Matau Matatou yeah 
The Kanoe Ma Mata 2. I remember this one uh, upset me as a kid a little bit as well. Because I, I was like, why would you name it that? Because this guy's name is Matau. So why would you call it the Mata Toe? It's, it's one letter off. They added the T. Uh, it gives him the power to move objects by sheer force or will. Where's the man himself? He's alone hunting Rahi in the drifts. You may seek him but if you wish, but be warned. He who's not merciful even to the Ko Koronen. Take this fastest way to enter the drifts. Patrol often leaves signal flags so he doesn't get lost. If you follow them, you may come to him. Goodbye. See, in addition to being a translator, he's also... Big Akaku, that's the, uh... Real talking at times. In addition to being a translator, he's also just a hunter. Yeah, signal flag. Signal flags. There you go. I always really liked this part as a kid. Because, like, the only thing you can see is this bright red flag, and you can't see anything past it. Until eventually you're just wandering. Like, if you look down, we can't see our, our like, feet. We can turn around as well, but we don't get a lot out of it. And then we can faintly see... Supposed to be able to faintly see... Man, this is really highlighting all the gunk on my screen. The flag there. Wow, it is snowy. There we go. Now, what does this say? Ends with an E. Is it X? The, yeah, that's, that's the, six letters, ends with an E. All right, I little, I literally paused the recording so I could go find um, a language cipher, which I did. I'm pretty sure the first word is hooky, and then the second one is, I mean, I don't know if that makes sense, but I think that's an H. No, it's not. It just says two dots. It doesn't have the lines. Dang. <clears throat> oh, it's a B. B E W. Yeah, I'm just actually trying to translate this now. Oh. Yeah, that's an A. Beware the. Well. I, I assume that that's, uh, that would have helped me earlier, but be where the snow probably got like an S and a W in the next one. Man, it's bad out here, guys. I've been in blizzards like this. Oh, it probably says beware the bow rock, huh? Because that's the bow rock symbol. I probably just couldn't see it in the snow. And hey, it's our good friend Matoro. Energy. Rest. I think that is a cane rod. Cane rod just means bull. It's a type of bull. Yeah! Kopak is so cool! That's the Huna, Mask of Concealment. Not invisibility, they specify concealment. I think you still cast a shadow, which is probably a direct Lord of the Rings reference. There's a different one called 
the full attack master stealth. Uh, that lets you mute yourself as well. And that's the, uh, Mask of Illusion. The one that Matau wears. Alright. Yeah, Kofaka. He's cool. I will translate Nuja's word for you, Traveler. So this also means that any secrets that the, that the Taraga have, because not all the Taraga bothered to learn Nuju's dumb bird language, uh, Maturo has to keep any secret that the Taraga says. Which is kind of a lot of stress on him. He's been watching you for a long time. Your own Mata Nui's destiny is more important than you know. Mata Nui sleeps, but you, like the Toa, shall be an agent in his awakening. Nuju knows you wish to ask questions of him, and he will answer. When you are done, you wish to ask a question of you. Where are the Toa? Toa, you unite and find more power in the joining. They shall merge their skills, knowledge, their wills to become wisdom and valor. Named in prophecy, Wairuha and Aki Akamai. In these forms, they have the Toa Kaito. So, um, let's see if I can... I do! So, this is a Lego set, so it would come with an instruction book, you know? And on it would be, you know, hey, here's the, these other things you can buy. And that's how you set up the Suva. So, um, you know, they show you how to build Liwa in here. Let me change from purple. Ah, blue's a little better, I guess. They would show you how to build him in here. And then at the end of the book, you get one of these. And it would show you how to rebuild Liwa and two other Toa, in this case, Gali and Kopaka, into a new Toa. Uh, one named Wairuha. Uh, and that's what a Kaita is. Um, and so, like, if you bought all three of them... Oh, I left the musical out again. Pardon me. Luckily, that was a very uh, demonstration and picture-heavy explanation. Um... So yeah, if you bought all three, you would have the complete instructions because each book had a one third of the instructions for the other ones. Uh, and if you bought all three, you would have all, all the instructions and you could combine them. You would make them into what is called a kaita and that's just a combination of three. There's also a combination of six, which is called a nui, uh, but no one's ever seen that happen with Toa. The Taraga have done it and Matoran have done it as well, but um, it's rare and requires unity. But yeah, um... Those are cool concepts that we never really got to see again past this. Because uh, almost nobody forms Kaita past the Toa Mata. They could even have retconned it and say that it was the Toa Mata's unique ability. Because a lot of Toa teams have a unique ability. And, like, the only thing is, like, the, the Metru were uh, pretty baseline. But, um... Anyway. What question? You're the one other guy, the, the Motoran. But only if you learn what was necessary to learn during your travels. With the Toa Kaita beneath the earth, the Tohunga must the Motoran must fortify their villages and brace for a great battle. There must also be created an alliance, a small group assembled from whoever the Turaga can spare, to help the Toa on their final quest. The usual question is this To what place shall you lead the alliance? I don't remember this. So be it. Niju believes you are the one who can accomplish this task. Is that the only one you're supposed to pick? Because, like, it would make sense. It's the only one that we're, um... Yeah, I guess we're supposed to go there. Niju believes you're the only one who can accomplish this task. Take this message to all the Turaga so they can begin their fateful preparations. Niju believes in you, Adventure. All right. So yeah, I believe this is the group called the Chronicler's Company. Uh, they're a tag team of one Matoran from every village and uh, Takua, who is, as you recall, who we're playing as. Um, Takua is, ooh, that sound is weird. 
Takua is thought of as a Tamatoran, but he doesn't spend all of his time in Tama, uh, in Takoro, um, in Tamatoran land. And just, you know, bounces around the island. It's a whole thing. It's his backstory. Thank you for showing this to me. Your noble is your reputation and resourceful. Okay. Oh yeah, I also have to go see Jaller. So for whatever reason, there are two people who have the same mask as Jala, but everyone else has a red Kakama on, so maybe it's just what the guards wear. This guy has a red Miro. He's, uh, he's looking pretty cool. We will not go quietly. Uh, can I show you this, this thing, bro? Way to the North March? What news do you have? Hmm. Do I give this to you? I don't imagine I do. Heatstone? One mo. Alright, I can't figure out how to do this, but I've got an idea. That's complicated. Hold on. All right, I think it's two, four, one, three, one. Okay, two, four, one, three, two. There we go. All right, yeah, so I've got this other idea. I like how this is in a neutral place that you can never, like, this could be anywhere. You'd never know. Take me to Takora, please. I've got an idea. I was thinking that if, like, I come in this way. Let me turn around. Dang. I can't, I can't figure out what he wants. I hope this isn't another bug because I've gone like 90% of the way through this game. All right. It's talking to you. So people are related and other courage. Okay. So letter from Nuju. What's happening? Huh. When you click on progress, it gives you this. Okay, so I tried talking to Vakama here, and I also opened the original one and used the chapter skip. And all it does is uh, just, like, bring me to... Wasn't it? That was so close. All it does is just bring me to um There we go. I'm gonna try going to Gakoro this time. See if that does anything. Um But yeah, like I I think the game might be broken again. I hope it isn't. Oh, you guys are going to make me solve this puzzle again. 
Is there a monster that this actually keeps out? Pretty lame monster, I must say. Um, if I can't figure out how to get it to work, I'll try figuring it out off screen. Uh, and if that don't work, I don't know. Hello again. Can you accept this? Thank you, Adventure, for showing this to me. Your nobles are reputation and resourceful. Okay. I'm going to try giving this to all the all the Turaga uh, next time. But until then, I've been Alfred. This has been the Mata Nui Online game. We're finishing it. Uh, it's getting finished. I'm happy about this. Uh, I'll see you guys next time, though. Uh, bye.